Welcome to the Poor Man's Gourmet Kitchen, where we share gourmet recipes at a low budget wonder. Now check this out. Here we've got half sliced bacon, mozzarella cheese, and these flaky grands biscuits. What we're gonna do is cut these in fours. Now just press into it, flatten it out real good. Want it just wide enough to fit in one of these mozzarella cheese squares. Just don't want it too thin. And just fold it over and squeeze it all together so it's completely covered. Nothing to it really, it's just that easy. Now once we got that, just peel up a piece of bacon. Like I said, these are half sliced cut pieces of bacon. Just about a five inch slice, but you just wrap it around like so, and then slam a toothpick in the middle so it doesn't come apart. Just like that. Okay. And once you get a plate full of them, just take them to your fryer. Oil should be about 350 degrees. I'm using peanut oil and I only use enough to cover the whole height of the cheese bombs. That way I don't waste a lot of oil. You can bake these, technically, if you're going for less fat, but this is the way to get them done quick and get them done right. Now it's good to pull these out one at a time like this and throw them on paper towels, but I'm telling you, these things ooze out the cheese, and if you don't want to waste your mozzarella cheese, don't put it on paper towels, because it'll stick to it and you'll never get it off. So you might want to just take this out and put them on a plate, and on a plate only. And there you have it. Cheese bombers with bacon oozing mozzarella right here in the poor man's gourmet kitchen thank you for watching and be sure to stop by poormansgourmetkitchen.com for more recipes and exact ingredients